previously on Survivor Roleplay. Now you take it steady, Penny. I'll be here for you if you need me. Dennis, I need to tell you something, but please keep this a secret. Whatever you do, don't tell Wynne. Ah, you have my word. I'm pregnant. Oh, I know. How did you know? I I didn't come down in the last shower, Penny. I've been around for longer than you, and I've seen this before. Do you think Wynne has figured it out too? Well, what did you tell him? Just that I'd not been drinking enough. A lie? Hmm. Penny, I know you two haven't exactly been seeing eye to eye recently, but I can promise you that if he finds out you're keeping secrets from him, it will not end well. Maybe I don't want it to end well. Look, I know you're confused and a bit upset, but the two of you were made for each other. And now you're having a baby together. You should be so happy. Dennis, the baby isn't wins. Oh, blimey. Ah, there we go. All rolled and sheeted. So that can now ferment. We already do have quite a bit of silage here. We might end up selling it. We managed to make a lot of money um, earlier in the day. So that's going to be like a reserve. But the cows over here will need to have some more silage at some point. At the moment, they're doing all right. So yeah, I need to go and take this JCB back to Peter because obviously it is his and we shouldn't really keep it on the farm if we don't need it. So I'm going to do that first of all. But then we have lots of work to do in the fields. We've got all these fields that need to be fertilized. We're going to spray them and we're going to obviously put liquid fertilizer onto them. We've got the um, IBCs here, but we might have to buy some more potentially. Oh, way up. Oh, blimey, Dennis. Good grief. Oh, sorry, Wynn. Uh, well, I wanted to tell you something in private. Can it wait? I'm sort of busy. I need to go and take the JCB back. Well, it's quite important. Okay, um, can I take the JCB back first? I guess you can. Blimey, Wynn. You need to calm down. Okay, I'll just do this then. <laughs> then I'm all yours. Right, alright. See you soon, Wynn. Probably wants me to have a look at his hammer collection again. Okay, let's start this up. And we will head over there. My Land Rover is already over there. So, yeah, we can come back. It's going to be quite slow getting there, but at least we can drive back quite quickly. This thing's top speed is like 13 miles per hour or something ridiculously slow. It would be good to start work on the, uh, the house at some point. I need to really talk to Peter about buying that plot so that we can rebuild it. Uh, I think if we can incorporate it into the farm, then maybe we could even rent out the, uh, the house. Or it could just be the farmhouse for me, possibly. No, it's supposed to be for me and Penny, but yeah, she she seems cold. I'm still awake. <laughs> We're still going, but we have arrived at Peter's farm. So yeah, we'll just get this parked. I think he, he usually keeps it around the uh, grain silo, so we'll put it there, which is pretty much where I've parked my Land Rover anyway. Yeah, we'll put it here. Should be fine. Ah, oh, Peter. All right, Win. How you doing? Just the man I wanted to speak to. We've got a work experience student coming down to your farm next week. Uh, really? Uh, things are pretty hectic, Peter. Ah, oh, you'll be right. She's keen to learn. Uh, okay then. Uh, that's fine. Who is she? Uh, to be honest, I don't know the details. Just a young lady, and she is very interested in farming. <laughs> okay, brilliant. I look forward to it. Anyway, I was just going to pick up my Land Rover. Uh, well, don't let me stop you. See you later, Win. See you, Peter. Interesting. Never had anyone on work experience before. I guess Peter doesn't want them here. So he takes them down to my farm. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm sure we can give her a, a job or two on the farm. It's not really uh, too challenging, the work that we have down there. It's just a lot to do. Just, yeah, it's not really difficult. Uh, maybe we can get her going on a tractor or something. We'll have to see. Anyway, yeah, let's get this taken back to my farm, and we are going to have to start spraying. Really, really want to speak to Penny. 
Not all of these fields need fertilizer. I think some of them have already had their quota. Um, so we're going to have to look at the farm book and see which ones still need it. I know the ones further up the hill there do need it. They're desperate for fertilizer. Yeah, that pile of rubble, it just looks so bad. We don't want that there. Oh yeah, Dennis wanted to speak to me, didn't he? Better go and find Dennis. Uh, he's probably in here with his feet up. Oh, when you're back. I am indeed. So, uh, are you going to tell me about that hammer of yours? Uh, oh, well, I can if you want. What, are you saying that's not what you wanted to talk about? Uh, no. It's a bit of a delicate matter, actually. But I do feel it's my responsibility to tell you. Go on, then. Uh, well, it's Penny. Well, uh, I don't know how to say this, Win. But Penny's pregnant. Wow. That's amazing. Uh, don't get too excited, Win. The baby isn't yours. What are you saying, Dennis? What do you mean it isn't mine? Well, I think you can probably read between the lines. I'm sorry, Wynn. I thought it best to tell you. Dennis. I don't know what to say. Come here. Come here, lad. Oh, let me get you some water. Oh, actually, all no, this stuff's brown. Now, forget about it. It's all right, Dennis, don't worry. I just need a minute. Oh, it happens all the time when... <sighs> Thanks, Dennis. How could you do this to me? Oh, well, I'm always here if you need to talk to someone. <sighs> I, I don't know, Dennis. I <laughs> just... I don't know. Thanks, Dennis. <laughs> How could she do that? How could she do that to me? Oh, these things happen when... It's all part of life. Take a seat, Wynn. This is my pub. I'm now the rightful owner. <laughs> I feel absolutely awful. <sighs> How could she do this to me? She's been with somebody else behind my back. All this time. Anyway, Dennis owns the pub now. He hasn't changed the name yet. It's good to see. I'll have to uh, do the fertilizer spraying tomorrow now. I uh, I don't think I have it in me, to be honest. There we are, Win. You have a drink of this. Much better than the water at the farm. Same colour, actually. <laughs> Same colour as our beer. Thanks, Dennis. I guess... That's the end then. Uh, it's up to you, Wynne. Well, where is she? Well, she's gone. Uh, I think she might have run away. Great. Brilliant. So she wasn't the person I thought she was after all. Uh, well, I, well, I wouldn't like to say, Wynne, to be honest with you. But it would appear so, yes. <sighs> Thanks for being here, Dennis. I appreciate it. Any time. Well, I guess I feel a bit better this morning. Need to keep it mind off her as much as I can um, yeah so yeah we'll do the spraying uh, maybe I'll never hear from her again <laughs> wow
She would actually abandon me and her business up there. For some other man. <sighs> okay, right, so let's um let's get that sprayer attached to this tractor, we'll get into that field. We have so much work to do. It would actually be good as well. Well, we've just returned the JCB, but it would be good at some point to spread manure on the grass fields. Right, put the PTO shaft on. And we're good. We're going to go fill it up. Yes, if we are going to put manure on the grass field, it wants to really be before the grass grows too much. Okay, so there we go. That's now full. Let's go and spray. We're on. All nozzles are switched on. That's good. So this will be the second application of fertilizer this field has had. Um, it will be the same for most of them. I did look in the farm book. And yeah, the small fields over on the far side have had no fertilizer at all. So they're going to need two applications. And one of them, there's a wheat, I think it's a wheat field over there. Um, that one has had both. That doesn't need anything at all. The others have all had one. So they need another application. So basically, pretty much every single field except for one needs to be fertilized. Which means we're going to have to spend a fair amount of money on fertilizer. Thankfully, a little does go quite a long way with this sprayer. Now, it's going to need probably multiple refills just on this one field alone. But, yeah, it's not empty in like 30 seconds, which is good. <sighs> Seeing her workshop just brings back all the memories. I don't know what's going to happen if she's run away. It's going to hit me really hard soon. Um, but yeah, how could, how could she? How could she do this? <sighs> anyway, <laughs> I've got to try and take my mind off her. Let's spray the field. Let's just do one more tank load. We've just got a tiny bit left to do up there. Didn't quite finish, unfortunately. Uh, but as I said, yeah, a little goes quite a long way. So we've still got those bells there. They need to be used. Now we're going to start spending the farm money. I'm looking to buy a bigger trailer. Um, well, well, a big trailer, ideally. Uh, eventually we'll get a, a bigger tractor, but it's not a priority. We've got the case. Um, so I think probably first things first, a trailer, uh, it would also be good to have a telehandler, definitely would be handy, but don't want to keep borrowing Peters, although trying to find one in our price range is going to be quite tricky, but I don't really like 
front load. Well, I, I much prefer telehandlers over front loaders. It's really just this top corner. There we go. Yeah, that, was, that should be pretty much it. Uh, I might just get this piece here. Good. This field actually has never been fertilized before, so that is the first application. I'm hoping I can still do a second application before it is ripe. Uh, we can't really spray it once it's ripe. And the other fields, the, the ones further down, they have had nothing either. So definitely behind on the fertilizing front, but we can soon change that. Oh, hey, oh. Blimey, this is like Flitz Riddleford. Oh, what a lot of fun. Going like the clappers. Hey. There we are. Right. Way up with that. What's Dennis doing? What's he doing with Fletch's bike? Hey, hey Dennis. What are you up to? Uh, well, I was just, uh... Making my way up to the farm on that bone shaker, I spotted this note. Somebody had stuck it to the wall. Let's have a look. Hmm, it's from Penny. She's been here. Oh, what does it say then, Wynn? <sighs> I don't believe it, Dennis. She's unbelievable. <laughs> 